Hey everybody, welcome back. Northern Lion gets dangerously close. Dangerously close to a victory in Wizard of Legend, but doesn't quite get there. I'm knocking on the door, do you hear that? That's me. I'm gonna be the last person to beat the game, but I'm still knocking. I'm getting close. Alright. Random.org has been very kind to us, in my opinion. Give me three... Give me four integers between 1 and 30. That is like 400 integers. Okay, give me four integers between 1 and 30. It took too long to generate. I feel like it's not actually random because of the time it took. If it took you that long to think about it, maybe there was a methodology behind it. 19, 12, 14, 13. 19, 12, 14, 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, so 18. 19 is Flame Strike Basic. 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Uh oh. 14. Now here we got a thousand of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Crashing Meteor. And 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I do love Shock Nova. It's a little bit... Oh, that's kind of interesting. I mean, I don't really rely on my dash to do damage, so it's really just a bonus, I guess, but... Alright, I, I see where this can go. I haven't used Meteor Strike before, I haven't used the dash before, everything else we've used a, a hundred thousand times before. I'm gonna buy some relics this time. We probably should be starting with different relics. Dude, we're not even close here. Why are you taking so long? One second. Does anything cost 10 exactly? Perfect. Um, we probably should be starting with different relics. That being said, I like using Surefire Rocket. We could mix it up a little bit. People are probably like, mix it up. People are probably like, buy more robes. I'll tell you that. A hundred percent. I guarantee we got a lot of people saying, buy more robes, and you're not wrong. Defeating foes lowers active cooldowns. I don't trust myself to use that properly. Allows you to destroy enemy projectiles with melee basic arcana. All costs for relics are discounted. Gets heavier as you progress through the trials. Drop from inventory to open. Yo, that's kind of interesting, huh? I've never used it, so I'm willing to give it a shot. So I'm thinking, basically, like, the longer you go through the game, the more, uh, money this gets. And then when you break it, you get all the money. Lebowski. Well, we're already overhealed. That's a great start. What's our game plan? I have no idea. All I know is I have used... Really? I have used Shock Arcana before, and I actually think it's like a really, really good signature. It's what Kate used when she and I beat the game. And really, it was mostly her, to be honest with you, but I feel like finally... You! Like, finally, I'm starting to get to the point where I can, you know, contribute myself a little bit here. Thank you very much. We've had a couple of really, really strong runs in a row. Didn't get a win on any of them, but we almost pulled it out. We we hit Oblivion on the last run, and then we pulled it back, and it felt awesome. Felt awesome. What is Sano's headband? You can no longer be interrupted while activating Arcana. I love it. Adds a chance to burn foes. I can live with it. Hoping we get enough gold for an Arcana on this floor, or alternatively a Pinata. Now, I know you, you, you might be saying NL. You know, I'm not going that way. I, I hate that pit there. And Al, you, you feeling under the weather? You sound a little not so great today. I can't believe I just did my due diligence and then got hit anyway. Um, because of my own idiocy, to be clear. Uh, I slept really, really badly last night. And it's always the worst, because when you sleep badly, but you know you're going to sleep badly, at least you prepare yourself for the inevitability of it. But I went to bed early. I thought I was going to have a great night. This is a real story, and trust me, I've already been hit with the innuendos, so I understand where you're going to go for this from a, a humor standpoint. Um, I woke up like 3 a.m. because the cats were freaking out. So I rolled over, I sleep on my stomach or my side. I did like a 180 McTwist in the bed, 
in one smooth motion to go like, hey, knock it off, you two, like they understand English. Uh, and in doing so, somehow the planks that are underneath the bed and the mattress, you know, it sits on them, got shifted and knocked off. And as a result, the whole bed just fell like eight inches. And that's the kind of thing, I mean, I tweeted about it, but... You know, if I hear a cat throwing up at four in the morning, I'm like, I'll deal with it tomorrow. You know, if I hear, oh, something got knocked down in the kitchen, I'm like, oh, I'll deal with it tomorrow. When your bed breaks, you pretty much just have to handle it immediately. So, you know, that was only like five minutes, but five minutes, being woken up out of nowhere and being forced to do a five minute task that requires you to use the non-sleepy part of your brain, that's enough to disrupt it. And, Whenever I uh, don't sleep so well, I always, I always get the old NL voice. I don't know what the methodology is behind it. Life goes on. I don't like feel terrible. It's just that, you know, it, it's a it's a privilege just to wake up. It's always been my hypothesis on it, so I'm not too upset about the fact that my sleep wasn't that good. I mean, life goes on, right? But by the way, if you said, well, if you think that's bad, try having a baby. Why why do you think? You know, I haven't done that. You know, I, I love sleeping. It wasn't my decision for you to have your child. So I don't see why you're trying to push it on me like a, like I'm somehow slacking. By not adding a life into this overpopulated world yet. Somehow that's my own fault somehow. Somehow, to be honest. Honestly, TBH. Um, so we got 213 gold. That is enough to buy an Arcana. I might consider buying the earth that grasps dude it is annoying not having a signature arcana that charges up on the regular there we go like I just feel like we're a little bit uh... oh there we go we actually got one just feel like we're a little bit underpowered relative to where we normally are at this stage of a run, but, you know, life goes on. Uh, we got no, we got one HP out of that. 263 gold. I think we should buy an Arcana. And I'll buy Grasping Earth. Starts off at max radius, crushes enemies more quickly. Grasps all foes in the area with giant stone fists. So I think this, you grasp them with the E, you hit them with a meteor strike and a lightning bolt like simultaneously, and no enemy on Earth should be able to stand up to that. Let's, let's test that theory. Beautiful, great start. I mean, it seems pretty dope. Hey, hey. Just trying to obliterate you here. You got a problem with it? So far, it's a little bit spottier relative to our more recent runs, but you know. I was gonna say life goes on, but that's really like up to us to decide. That's kind of the whole point of the video is to figure out whether or not that's actually gonna be the case. So I know people are gonna be watching this with bated breath. You know, it's must-see entertainment. Ever since ABC uh, has canceled Roseanne, now everybody's like, I gotta see what's going on in this Wizard of Legends series. I'm thinking uh, the piggy bank. I, I really like this actually. Arc Sphere is like a big old uh, ball of lightning that you can just bust off in an enemy's face. I keep getting freaked out when I see the meteor, thinking it's like the enemy meteor. Which is a sentence that doesn't sound right. <laughs> it's like my name of Jeff, the enemy meteor. It sounds like a pizza you'd order at a, a nerd-run barcade. I'll have a... The pan is meteor? Look, I'm one of you, okay? I can make the joke. Now... I'm thinking... The piggy bank... It's like break in case of emergency. So if I really desperately need HP and I don't have the means uh, to buy it, that's like one pretty pivotal opportunity for us to break it. Apart from that, I'd like to wait until like 
if not as long as possible, maybe like 3-1 is optimal. Why 3-1 instead of 3-2? Because 6-8-9, uh, does that answer your question? Because uh, if we don't like what's in the shop on 3-2 and we break the piggy bank there, we're going to end up buying a lot of trash. If we do like what's in the shop, then sure, it's probably the optimal solution, right? But What I will say about this run... So this is like, dodge, reduce earth damage, get some armor, enhanced water damage, I think, so or enhanced aqua arcana damage to be more clear, so probably worth nothing. I'd really like to buy the lightning sphere on this floor. Um, we have good lockdown with Grasping Earth. And then on top of that, our raw damage output is actually really, really high. We're a little bit lighter in the damage department than I'd like to be. But I think that this run, you know, it, it's very early, but I think it has every available chance for something to happen here. Oh. I'm a little displeased that, unfortunately, uh, my hands grasped, gra it's a tough word, grasped, grasped, nothing, despite the fact that there were enemies on the screen, but hey, that's, that's life, you know, sometimes your basic arcana betray you and lie to you. So that's, uh, Lightning Sphere, I don't think you, I, I used it, uh, in the win with Kate again. Which you can go see on her channel if you want to see it. Is this a sponsored stream? Well, you know. We're married, so, like, according to the Canadian government, like, everything she does, I get half of, and everything I do, she gets half of. So, pretty much, you know, every stream is sponsored by each other. There we go! That's the ticket right there. Light on HP, not much we can do about it. We're going to have to, um... I, I'm real, real pleased with where we're at right now. But, we are going to have to recover some of our HP. So, as rich as it would be to suggest this, it's like, you know, John Madden saying to win in football, you got to score more points than your opponent. Um, but it would be incredibly sick if we beat this guy without taking any damage whatsoever. Oh, no kidding. So that was pretty good. This is the garbage attack. Let me out, please. Wow, that's disappointing. I got trapped behind a tree. I thought I could just walk through it, which in hindsight, you know, when has that ever worked for anybody over the course of human existence? Please don't do your ultimate. The absolute madman did his ultimate. That was not a great fight, but all things considered, it's not that bad. We're gonna have to accept that in all likelihood. Oh, that's just... Wait a minute. No, I hate this one. <laughs> it's like the one that punches people down. It's a, a gap closer, let's say. Um, we're in, all likelihood, in all likelihood, we're gonna have to buy HP on this floor. It's not terrible, because I actually think... I actually think in terms of our, like, relic situation, we're pretty well off right now. Not relics, arcana. In terms of our relic situ- oh. <laughs> in terms of our relic situation, we could always use a little bit more. There we go. They're not dead! I recognize you are, like, fire knights. Don't get me wrong. But still, I didn't think you had the... I didn't think you had the guts. So compared to the last run, we're definitely missing that, like, game-winning wombo combo. That ended up, uh, not winning us the game, but, you know, in theory, it could have won us the game if I knew what I was doing. Alright, so that was extremely cool and sick. 
Stop trying to attack these guys endlessly. God, I hate this enemy. Just be smarter and attack them three times and then get the heck out of town, you know? It's not that hard, supposedly. I will forego healing for something on this floor, but the something has to be really good. Or we can get it in addition to if we have the gold, but it's going to have to be real impressive. Like, vampire's robes, or vampire's glasses, and anything with crit, absolutely. I've, hear, I've heard that that's like a, an incredible combination, but, you know, there's crit robes, and then, uh, ooh, hello. Crit robes and vampire's eyeglasses. Considering you can start with both of those, that seems like the, like, de facto, if you just want to beat the game, take this combination. I may resort to that at a point in my life. I don't think there's anything wrong with it, necessarily. I don't even want to buy this just yet, you know? I'd rather, uh... I'd rather see what awaits me. I'm very surprised we didn't get hit there. That was kind of an overly aggressive start. That was bad. Better, but we did take damage. This should do it. When you get the signature, it's like game over. We got 25 HP. Man, it's always a slap in the face, huh? Had a pretty good boss fight, got hit once. Took 35 damage, healed for 25 afterwards. Pretty much cements us in like HP purgatory right now. Now you, I know you give me a bunch of money. Overpriced insurance. Wasn't that like... I forget overpriced insurance. I know we had it, and I believe that after having it, I said, well, we shouldn't have done that at all. And the ominous bank loan is actually pretty interesting, because it gives you a bunch of gold uh, immediately. And then over time you pay it off, and presumably you pay off like way more than you had ever uh, spent in the first place. So in terms of Arcana, like, is this, no, I thought it was Evading Zephyr. All the wind ones look very similar to me. Alright, well we should buy HP. Yeah. And what are we doing on relics? We're on like three? We're on three relics. Buy HP. I actually think Royal Flush is pretty okay, but what's Wallet of Vigor? Let's give it a try. Purchase items with health when you don't have sufficient gold. Mmm, that seems highly bad right now, but... I mean, maybe that's why it cost a hundred. <laughs> it's actually, it's great if you can overheal. Uh, if you can have, you know, so much healing available. Really good idea. If you can have so much healing available on the floor... that you're not doing anything with it. It's basically just free gold. But for us right now, it seems real bad. I do kind of feel like I'm caught in a purgatory right now. Don't say no escape from reality. Open your eyes, look up to the sky and see. I'm just a poor boy. I need no sympathy because I'm easy come, easy go. Little high, little low. Anyway, the wind blows. Doesn't really matter to me. To me. Mmm, this guy wins the internet today. I'm still kind of rocking, uh, you know, yesterday's breakfast in terms of my, like, mental use of these arcana. Like, I'm always right-clicking to interrupt enemies, which is idiotic because our right-click is like a slow meteor drop now. I'm not giving up on this run. And, you know, if you really believe that I am, first off, I'm insulted. Genuinely. Secondly... Yesterday should be all the indication you need that I don't give up on a run easily. Did we botch it? Absolutely. We, we botched the Christ out of that last run. On the other hand, we did also come back from Oblivion. I had to pop it. 
our signature was almost done. You know, we were in a terrible spot by the end of yesterday's, did I say daily? By the end of yesterday's run, we were in a terrible spot. And yet, uh, managed to almost, and I do mean almost, beat the final boss. This one, though, I don't know. Again, not giving up. The damage is real slick. I think I might have gotten a little bit too used to the uh, luxury. Excuse me! <laughs> a little bit too used to the luxury of uh, being able to heal so readily. And, I mean, we're getting a little healing back, but... Eh, we got, like, 75 there. That's pretty good. Now we're in that state where it really seems like every single floor we have to buy HP, and that's where, you know, things get real troubling. Because we're not committing ourselves to improving the run as much because we're not able to commit ourselves to improving the run as much. But, I can't deny... It's real slick when it works. So you take an Arcana... And then you make, you give me some health related somethings. I just don't want to fight all you guys in the same area right here. Especially like Fire Mage is the actual worst. That worked very well. 299 gold. So we'll end up buying some gold. Absolutely. I would love to buy more relics. A big part of the reason I think that these runs that are close to winning don't actually come through in the end is because of the fact that my relic knowledge is still quite bad. And I don't think too many people would dispute that. That was such a stupid move to... Basically, I chose to take damage against that guy. I was like, alright, he's gonna get in his attack, but I'm gonna get in mine as well. I've been told that I was incorrect and... Uh, Evading Zephyr is actually like one of the best relics in the game, which is why I'm looking for it. We need it. I think I will take Dark Katana. Doesn't it do something with related to crits? Triples critical hit chance for all melee arcana. See, I have no idea. Um, but then... I think I will... Let's go. I think I will try to do that, whatever is happening in that, like, medical lab over there. This was actually much, much better. Because, uh, and it's red? Yeah. Sure, take an Arcana. I don't really want you to, but... You took Crashing Meteor. We got Critical Placebos. Makes you believe all your attacks result in critical hits. Again, I don't... Expect that to be good. <laughs> Not even close, but uh, it's something at least. And I was trying, basically, you know, if you're on an airplane and it's crashing. We also healed a little bit off of it, so we're back to full HP, which is kind of incredible. But um, if you're on an airplane and it's going down, push the stick in, pull the stick up, rotate it side to side. Do anything but stay on the current trajectory. No, I've never been to flight school. How could you tell? They probably have, like, a, you know, a way that they would prefer to handle things. But I don't know what that is, okay? I'm ignorant. Oh. Oh, good. Just uh, attack in the wrong direction. Oh! Dude. Okay, the right click... I think it might be worse than nothing, with the way that I'm using it at least. This attack, just take a deep breath, it's pretty likely to always hit you, at least when I use it. I don't know how we didn't get hit more there. Let's go, let's go, let's continue to go. I hate... I gotta use the gap closer, dude. Probably... Yep, 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 yep. 
Like, the thing is, we get such a small window with which to actually attack. Oh my god, we almost botched it there, too. That I gotta close the gap faster. Oh, absolutely. Give me this instead of my right click. Alright, so we're back to 321 HP, which is, you know, I'm more comfortable being a little bit lower on the HP front. <laughs> it's, it's what I deserve. So I'm gonna smash this, uh... Well, we might as well wait till we get to our first shop, I guess, but I'm gonna smash the piggy bank. We made it. We can at least see how much gold we get out of the piggy bank. I really... I'm not messing with you. I think I needed to be, like, 400 gold. Wow, that was horrendous. Uh, why do I need it to be 400 gold? Because I went four floors without a default starting relic. That's horrible. It's just not good at all. Merchant's cart. Increased damage based on number of relics in inventory. Alright. So yeah, I would say that uh, starting with the piggy bank, it did probably lead to me getting more gems. It looks like. I can't deny. We're looking pretty rich. Oh my god. We're looking pretty rich from a gem-related standpoint right now. Unfortunately, I don't think that's really what we're looking for in order to win the game right now. Oh my god. Dude, I think we actually did a pretty good job right there. Did I actually say right there? My brain went straight back into Chingy territory. Which might as well be the title of his first album as far as I know. So this floor... We have a curse shop. <laughs> I, I'm, if I have to, I will, okay? And have to is a really, really great phrase for me because it basically means it's up to my discretion, which means I probably won't take him. Not because I think the curse shops are bad, just because uh, oftentimes I'm less than capable of taking advantage of the positives and more than capable of taking advantage of the negatives. But it's a, uh, it's a journey. So that worked, somehow. I don't know. I feel like maybe I've been sleeping on this run. Pop this immediately. Get in there. There we go. That's the ticket. You know what? You got me on that one. You came by it honestly. It doesn't mean I'm not mad. Now I'm extremely mad about that one. You got me with some honest damage there. I can't be too, too mad. I always do right-click when I should be doing R. Wow, we got through this floor insanely quickly. That was pretty solid. Might get him. Didn't it did get him? Okay, that was really, really good. We got up to 213 gold. HP could be better, but we know we want to buy more relics. Let's go um Wanderer's Mechanism. Increases the damage of your signature arcana. Okay, I can live with that. I don't remember what the abacus does. I don't remember what a lot of relics in this game do. All I know right now is that the more relics I get, the more damage I do, the more damage I do, the less time I'm gonna have to spend on the final boss fight. Now, be careful what you wish for, because that could just mean you die on the final boss fight. Did you hear that? (laughs) 
I can't even tell, like, how we're doing right now, because, again, every attack looks like it crits. Enemies. Enemies! Perfect. Now, we have Earth. We don't have... We... We don't have wind, no. I swear, like, I'm being forever punished for the fact that I squandered that one elemental chest that I totally had access to, and now the game is like, well, we're never gonna give you one that you can open again. I'm just making sure I really don't have wind, right? Because people get mighty ornery about that, and for good reason. We only had 17 opportunities to buy wind as well, so... You know, it's it's not fair, dude. There's nothing I could have done. I feel like uh, giants. Oh, singing bowl. Singing bowl was really amazing. Didn't quite work. You saw my master plan, though. Um. There we go. So I probably am... Oh, you idiot. In my opinion, I still want to get Singing Bowl. I think at this point, we probably have to do something like this. I don't remember what Tortoise Shield does. Let's try Flashy Boots. Triples dash, but lowers movement speed. I remember this now, and I hate it immensely. How many times can I be tricked into buying the same thing over and over? I'm like, I don't like tortoise shield. Tortoises are slow. I don't want to be slow. I want to be fast with these flashy boots. Well, all we have to do is press the space bar anytime we want to move. When you put it that way, it's not so bad. Sort of. I got a new strat, by the way. Instead of stun locking enemies with the grasping earth, I think what we do is we stun lock them with the lightning, and then we throw the grasping earth in after. So we do something like this. And, like, that looked pretty sick. I don't... like this very much right now. 24 hit combo? Why are you still so alive? Alright, that's the best we've ever done there. Please just kill him. HP could be worse, dude. Let's be real. That's not so bad. So we're on 274. Still have one shop to go to. 247, I should say. Still have one shop to go to. Um, and that's got to be next to blue. Down from blue? No. Down from the portal. Mask man in the street. I don't know how to sing. Um, 96% of the floor, so you probably have like one room, and yeah, okay, sure, yeah. I think you have to take your enhanced flame strike, and then you have to walk around looking for healing, which is a lot of fun. Uh, but I, I stand by this. We need to buy the healing potion, that was only 2-1, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had to buy the healing potion, and an upgraded version of our basic arcana, in my opinion, and again, it's a worthless opinion, because I don't know what I'm doing in this game, much of the time, but it's like the most core upgrade you could ever ask for. There's a couple little, there's things I would change in uh, Wizard of Legend, you know? I would get rid of the half-size platforms over pits. I think those are the most annoying. Apart from that... I recognize that what I'm doing right now is a user choice, but the game has incentivized me to run around looking for gold. And there we go, we got it. We were rewarded for it. I wish that they just said, hey, we're dropping like 5% more gold per floor, but inside of the pots and 
chests and stuff, you don't get any. And I know that people were like mad at Gungeon for that to some extent. They're like, why are there even pots here? When I break them, there's not gold. That's like video game 101. Yeah, but then like you don't spend five minutes walking around waiting for a pot to give you the HP that you need, which I think is way more annoying. <laughs> So, I'm just, like, dashing like my life depends on it. No! I knew I was gonna get caught there. Probably panicked a little harder than I should have. This attack is not that bad. She's good, let's, oh, I botched it. I hit the wrong button and she guarded. No ulties, please. That was really dumb. Okay, well, I guess we'll be doing this again. Okay, sure. You know, I can't really be mad. Pretty much entirely my own fault. Uh, we should be on like 400 HP is my guess. What are you? Heroic Leap. Well, we have to look at the positives where we can get them, alright? Run 350 HP. We have to look at the positives where we can get them. What are the positives? Dude, consistently making it to the final boss with relatively random arcana is pretty cool. So if you'll excuse me, I'm just going to focus for like the rest of my natural life here. You really just have to learn these attacks, I think. And that's our initiator. Okay, that was pretty good. Just don't get greedy. And also... No, 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 no. You gotta handle the orbs when they get created. Alright, so it's a real duel between wizards now, that's right. At least I got my HP back. Oh my lord! You know what? We have confidence now against this boss. We're getting there. I know, I know, I'm, I'm gonna miss this window. I'm probably going to die. We gotta take advantage of those windows whenever we get them! But I really am, believe it or not, getting more comfortable with fighting this boss. Okay. I understand the patterns a little bit more now. She always does like a signature. No! I really thought I was in the gap. She always does a signature and then you bounce in and get her. Dude, we're gonna get her. We're on the cusp. For now, it was a fun run in spite of the failure there at the end. If you enjoyed it, click the like button. It helps it a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you wanna see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching. I will see you next time.